from home this week because last week I uh, I was on holiday, but a holiday at home. And uh, first of all, I would like to say thank you for your sharing, uh, your wordings and condolences, and also some uh, financial support to my brother funeral ceremony. Uh, he got accident uh, before the Khmer New Year, and now I hope uh, with your sharing, uh, he he rests in peace now. Thank you for your sharing your condolences. And uh, I hope you enjoy your holiday, but maybe not cannot go to anywhere, but you can stay with your family. Right. Yeah, 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 teacher. Someone in Clovin, they is uh, no, they yeah, family has uh, happening. But someone in the time of <laughs> likes me, just stay home alone. And, and I'll do uh, a problem. situation develop uh, very fast sometimes we cannot predict and then we need to adapt to the, the change the situation is a very uh, you know changing so we need to adapt to the environment we are now in a such a more difficult than before uh, because of the COVID-19 situation so we cannot okay. go out and we need to to adapt to such a hard, hard time right to follow the government instructions because uh, this is for our safety as well. So uh, now, uh, because we uh, we will continue to discuss about the principles of the political realism, and at the same time, we also uh, discuss a little bit about the midterm because uh, the deadline for sharing the information with you is a uh, this week, right? 26th, right? Is it this week? Do you remember about the announcements of the midterm? So we check again about the midterm announcement and then uh, I need to inform you uh, this week about the question for your, uh, your work. Maybe uh, I prepare tonight or tomorrow and then I can share on Thursday, right? Yeah, I mean, the latest is this week because you need to, you need time to uh, search some information to complete the answer and send back to me by the deadline, right? So they have the specific date to collect the midterm. You got what I mean? Okay. Just let me know if you cannot hear me. Uh, and also, uh, there are some uh, work that we need to complete, like assignment or homework. Because so far we have completed only one homework, right? Is it correct? We will have one more homework before the midterm, and then uh, we can uh, evaluate for the first two months with the class activity, with the homework, and with the midterm exam. Midterm exam, okay. So uh, before I continue, uh, is there any question so far regarding the? The principle one and principle two of the the six principle of the political realism. Any question? Have you checked? Have you read the document and come up with the question now? I'm waiting for your question. If you have. The clock monitor, can you take a screenshot now? Yes, yeah, sir. Monitor. Or 
be screenshot. I see the suggestion from the class monitor to change your name into the real name so that you cannot, uh, you can avoid the confusion about the ticking at attendance. So it takes time if you, uh, if you cannot find your name properly, so it, uh, it, it causes your absence. Like uh, Saint Chan Sodawi, I think you can change to Saint Chan Sodawi, not Chan Sodawi Saint. So it will go to the bottom based on the alphabet order. You got it? Yeah, teacher, I have already changed it. Yeah, but I mean the, the surname or family name stand before your last, your name, right? So your family name is Seng, right? Yes. So Seng, Seng Chan Sok Dawi. So you just change the family name in front and then the class monitor can monitor properly. Okay, after this you can change. So uh, no questions regarding the sixth principle. I remember we complete the principle one and principle two already. I want to continue with the principle number three. No question, right? I can continue. No question, teacher. Yeah, but my question to you now with the with the principle one what is the keyword of principle one the keyword of first principle uh, focus on power objective law and human nature Repeat, I cannot hear you well. Maybe, it will be, maybe uh, because of internet connection. Okay, mom. Teacher, can you hear me? Yeah. Is it way up? Yes, child. Uh, first principle, the keyword uh, of this principle, focus on uh, the first one is power objective law and the last is a uh, okay. human nature no do you remember about the power what is the definition of power power is uh, some things that uh, we we are doing for the public interest not so right so who can help what is the definitions of power and how many kinds of power hello power is uh Definition of power and uh, how many kinds of power? power yeah, it should not. Uh, it should not keep quiet like that. It should have interaction. Teachers, um, power is the ability um, of doing something. Is it right? Authority, yes. So I listen to you now, I cannot say right or wrong, but I want to listen first because uh, from you, your definition from others. Yes, um, so power is uh, the ability or capacity um, uh, of doing something. And we have two kinds of power, legal power and illegal power. Okay. Who can say anything else about the power? Power is authority. 
but we still have one more definition. to make someone do what they don't want to do. This is power. Got what I mean? The ability to make someone do of what they don't want to do. This is power. Got it, sir. ក្រុមតែនិយាយថាលទ្ធភាពធ្វើអ្វីមួយហើយអំណាចអានឹងក្រំតែជាអំណាចតែកើតឡើងតែផ្ដល់នៅកម្លាំងឲ្យខ្ល
Hello. 
legal power ni
ຈັ່ງຕັກຕອງຫນ່ວຍພໍປະຍົດນັ້ນຄືມັນແມ່ນກະຕະປີອໍານາດຕາມຫນ່ວຍໃຫ້ໃນ Yes, ตีหลอดแบบว่าอันเมทอืม
Yeah, teacher. Yes. Yes, yeah, 